Let's see. Oh, oh my. Oh, Jesus oh. Christ. Oh man. Oh man. So we got we got pregnant Barbie. <laughs> it's natural. It's this natural is before thing. it's this is before it's time, dude. This is like uh teen mom before teen mom, bro. This this is this is pre-teen mom, I believe. And <laughs> Oh um, shit. So I did a little research into this because surprisingly, I don't know a lot about pregnant Barbie dolls. Um, it might shock you, but um, so it's actually her best friend Midge. And like Midge over the years was like Barbie's go-to girl, like a best friend. So they didn't want to make Barbie pregnant, I guess. So they're like, no. oh, we'll, make Midge, we'll make Midge pregnant. What the hell? Yeah, everybody has a friend named Midge who got pregnant in high school. Everybody has a midge in their life. So um, such a such a pop, this is such a popular name nowadays, Midge. So it was Midge and Alan, and the baby was Nikki. And I guess the idea was, you know, they're going to show about pregnancy and there. But but look at the picture. I don't know. Like it's, it's a, dude, just a, the one with with her, the transparent <laughs> like, baby, is upside down is disturbing, dude. Like you found the a, right picture. It's and it's magnetic too, from what I read. So it actually it's held in there by a, a by a magnet. And uh, I just you know obviously people they they took it off the shelves. So people were complaining. They're like, this is inappropriate. And I I think if it wasn't so shocking, like like the first few pictures, it's like all right, Midge is pregnant. Right. You know what happens? Part part of life. They call it like the family line. Pro. It's a, I forget what it was called. Something about families. Um, but then you have that. What it looks like. So hit the next slide, please, Jork. I got a little bit more of this one. So there's the family. I don't I don't quite understand the dynamic. I'm guessing that's Alan with Midge. I don't know. Is that the nan? I, I don't know who the other girl is with them, though. Like, and look at all the babies that are all around them. Like, what the hell happened? Like, well, I, how, how did this? Yeah. How did this happen? Considering the, I've seen uh, how these things are anatomically put together. You've seen Ken. Yeah. Yeah. Ken's a eunuch. How the hell did this happen? I, I how is don't... how is Ken levitating? That's another <laughs> oh. good point. Well, for, first of all, that's Alan Dork. Good, good, good call on the levitation. Yeah, you know what? He was a magician. I heard he disappeared as soon as that baby popped out, too. Yeah, yeah, that's that happens. Um, look at look at him floating. I don't know why he's he's he just he's so elated to have 50 babies surrounding him at this point. But he, he brought like his mistress to the the hospital right um that nobody wants to cover midge up like is that like i like i don't know like she could use a shirt or something you got a baby sticking it but so that's that's, that's poor midge 